Hi there, we are in Olympia, Washington, and we're gonna show you the hands-on children museum well, down here. Uh, we, we got some that. little Everly here, she's super excited. Are you excited to see the children's museum? Yeah, She's excited because you can touch a lot of stuff, which is awesome. So let's go see it. Nope, you know what this is? This is the path to imagination. And here we are. This is the Hands-On Children Museum. It's a really cool looking building. I've never been here before, but I know Mama and the kiddos have. And we're walking inside. This is the Hands-On Children Museum. So when you enter, they stamp your hand. Okay, and we are inside the Children's Museum. Oh, wow. Let's see what they got going on here. Oh, look, you can ride a goat. You can ride a goat. <laughs> you riding a goat? Yeah, look over here. Ride em pony. So this is a very barn themed area. They got some cool murals on the wall. Or maybe not barn, but th farm themed. Oh, and if you're tall, be careful, you might knock your head. Oh, look at this, it's a simulated kitchen. You gonna cook us some dinner? They got a little, okay. they got a cooktop. What's this right here? Is that a fish? Baby, look up here. There's ice cream. Yeah, this area is neat. There's like a simulated kitchen you can play in. They got an ice box. Look at that ice cream in there. I gotta open it. What? It's okay. Let's take Okay. Wow, look at this. I'm not quite sure. There's some voodoo magic behind this. Oh wow, my hand gets wet, but it's like steamy. Yeah, that's really neat. Your hand gets wet, but yeah. So kind of a cool thing you can do here is you can throw a ball up into this thing and it goes down. Oh, and then it goes down. It's, it's caught in the vortex. Nice. Okay, now you can, looks like you can race some rubber duckies. Well, they're floating down. So as you can see, there's a whole lot of different hands-on activities that kids can do. Things to touch, things to see. There's like a jungle gym area up top. And it's decorated really cute as well. Look at all the critters. Now from the looks of it here, you can be some sort of crane operator. Okay, let me see your best. Bring it down, I'll receive it. Or hold it, you want to come receive it? Okay, as we can see, Evie, she's cranking the crane. Oh, oh, the brother got it. Bring that one out, put a new one on. Brother got it, and boom! Put a new one on. Okay, put a new log on there. There you 
you go. Thank you, thank you. Other way, other way. This one, this one. You have to do this one. The red one pulls it this way. That's so neat. Okay, and this looks like the Queen Mary boat. If he's driving it. Oh, wow. Well, now look at Everly here. She is cranking away on that wheel. <laughs> they actually got some pretty cool props and set pieces here. Actually looks like some sort of uh, old oh, sailor radio. Oh I like, they got a lot of really cool murals on the wall. You see the ship here. The old Fords. There's like a Port of Olympia water tower. Okay, we're making our way back further into the area. And look, they got a mock police car here. Isn't that neat? And they also have. Oh, there's an animal hospital. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. And the police car even has lights on it. Evie, do you see the big red fire engine? Olympia Fire Department. Looks like a lot of this stuff is sponsored. They have an ambulance you can sit in here. Oh, and here's the animal hospital. What are you seeing here, Evie? You want to dress up? Yeah. Down in this veterinary area. They got like some critters back here you can look at. And they have a couple you can actually work on. Here. Now this place is right up her alley. She's been like a whirlwind since we've been in here. And she's just loving it. Just bouncing from place to place. So if you have little kiddos, this is a good place to go. Okay, what does he weigh? How much does he weigh? Like you. This one. Everly is a veterinarian right now. What do you? What kind of animal is that? It's a bunny. Is it a bunny? You can brush him. And as you can see, it's themed really nice. They got it's like some doctor implements, like a pet grooming station. And I like this the most. The x-ray. You can't, you, you gotta give him an x-ray? Everly's gonna give this bunny an x-ray. Oh, do you see? X-ray. Okay, can you see into his bones? Another cute area, looks like they have the South Sound Nursery. What have we got in here? Oh, it's a place where they have brand new babies, huh? Where's the doctor stuff? Are you gonna operate? This is doctor stuff. So as you can see, these different environments are very interactive. They have different props and environments you can play in. Look at this little guy. What's up, bro? Hey, did you wanna go hang your jacket up? So you can weigh the baby. Oh, they even give you instructions on how to swaddle your baby step by step. Now, Everly, she is an ambulance driver now. Let me see. Look at that. And there's our patient, patient zero. Hi. What's your ailment there, buddy? Uh, broken uh, chicken nugget. He has a broken chicken nugget, apparently. So, so this area is really neat. You can be a medic. You can drive a fire truck. They got a police car. And up in the corner there, probably one of the coolest looking ones, they have a helicopter. I might go show you that. Look at this. Now they're driving the police car. Oh, it's a canine unit. Look at this. Okay, you're in pursuit of a bad guy. Go get him. Come on, you got this. They're in hot pursuit of a perp. 
Now we're up here with Airlift Northwest. This is really neat looking, I like this. You gonna be your co-pilot, Holden? Sure. Are you being? This is Medivac Airlift 3. Here, I'll drive this one. Oh, look at you guys down in here. Oh, they got a flight stick Request and a bunch of buttons. Request Airlift 3, flight shelter for medical emergency. Olympia Tower, this is Medivac Airlift 3. Yeah, this is a pretty immersive experience with different vehicles you can try out. Yeah, it's, it's wonderful. The kids love it. Um, every Friday, the very first Friday of the month is only a dollar admission. So if you live locally or if you're in town visiting the Olympia area, be sure to check this out. This is a really budget friendly, family friendly activity. How much is it normally? It's about $16 normally for kids and adults. So normal price isn't all that bad, but definitely a dollar is better. Heck yeah. And you get four hours here, four to eight. Nice. Okay, we're leaving kind of the career area and gonna venture on further. Climb the tree up, and then we're gonna watch her take the slide back down the tree. Are you ready? Okay, gonna she's climb gonna the climb the tree. the tree. Brother will meet you up. Now this is like a cool sort of climbing area, as you can see, and she's making her way up. There she is. There she is, she made it all the way up top. Good job. Okay, here she goes. Down the slide. Let's go! He's coming out. Whoa! Okay, they got a microscope and then you can see it on the big screen. I'll focus. This is what your skin looks like. Look at the screen. Oh, that's Evie's. Oh. It's Everly's skin up close, weird. <laughs> and if you take a look, they have different moths and other things that you can put under the microscope to discover. And it's kind of wet, so it's kind of fresh. And Everly's a sensory seeker, so all this hands-on touching is really good for her. She likes normally, in most circumstances, she's not allowed to touch most things just because she gets into everything. But this is a place she can kind of run free and uh, have a great time. Okay, we've seen the majority of the downstairs. Now we're going to head upstairs and see what they have off the top. We are up here on the second floor. Okay, from the looks of it, they got some slides. Kind of an area you can run around and have fun. This is like a particular area that's just carved out for the younger kids, so four and under. So if you have babies, you can let them crawl around here, keep the younger kids, you know, a little more safe from being bumped into by the older kids. Yeah. This area was designed just for this guy. No. No? Sure. What's that right there? They're like, it moves. They're like gel underneath them. Oh, interesting. You kind of step on them and they squish funky. Hold up. And in this area, they have some dinosaurs and a volcano. Hey, so much time here. That's really cool looking. Yeah. We're heading towards this upper area. And there's a huge oyster. Oh, wow. So, look at the big pearl. That's a huge one. This is called the infant oyster bed. Oh, and even look down below. They got a little tiny uh, ship that wrecked there on the coast. This area up top is really nicely themed, very nautical. So as you can see, they have many, many different types of activities for all ages. It's like we're going through some sort of coral reef here.
Now what do we have here, Mama? <laughs> I guess you cut cut this in such a way. Let's see how they do it. Oh, it's a oh, it's deep. a wind tunnel parachute flyer from the looks of it. Did tell you how to do it there? This is a. Or a there's a helicopter as well. You can make one of two things oh, and then. Okay, there's two different designs. You can do a helicopter or you can do a parachute flyer like I did. Let's see how this thing works. Pretty rudimentary. Okay. Whoa! <laughs> Everly, come take a look at what Daddy made. You want to watch? You want to put this underneath? Come here. Okay, we're gonna watch as Evie puts this helicopter up. <laughs> Woo! Okay, let me see. <laughs> That's too much fun. Okay, Mom made the helicopter. Let's see how this one works. Oh. There we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Big money, big money. It's thinking about it. Oh, that's it. Okay, now. Yeah, I don't know. Huh. Oh, there it goes. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> well, the wind station was fun. You get to make a little item and then uh, have it fly through the air. It's called the wind tunnel. That's a pretty cool station. Take they got a thing off. here called take sock skating. Off. No shoes on the ice. I guess you take your shoes off and you skate all around. Okay, let me see how, it, how you do it. <laughs> you slide all Oh, careful. Careful, baby. That's slippery. I would try it too, but I'd fall and I'd hurt something. So. Yeah, yeah. That, when you it, get older, you got to be careful. You got to be cautious because that. that'll take you out for a couple of weeks. Hey, we've discovered a new area here. What is this contraption? Look at this thing. Wow. How does this work, Everly? Add one item at a time. Okay, okay, let me see what you got. Oh, wow, push it in there. Oh, oh my. Wow. Okay, Evie's gonna put that in the tube. And then as you can see, it eats it out the end there. That's quite a contraption. It's huge. This is called the Airways Maze. And this is the building place, it looks like. Build it. Oh, wow. So as you can see, oh, they got a wall of tools. They got some wrenches, a couple drills. They got a big old jackhammer. It looks like you can build little, little house things. They got a dump truck. Are you guys in the dump truck? I'm gonna put, load the rocks into the dump truck. And this is the arts and crafts area. It's like you can uh, make a dragon hat. Oh, it looks like they have Play-Doh you can play with. Look at that. What color is that? I, I don't know, but this gives you a hug. It's, it's almost crazy. red. It's, that, it's like clear like we had in school. Oh, yeah. And I know it's dark outside, but there is an outdoor area I'll show you real quick. Maybe a little hard to see, but it looks like there's some different activities. 
They got a lighthouse you can climb up to the top. They got an old ship. It actually looks like an actual sailboat. Oh, it's a vintage schooner. Isn't that something? It's kind of themed like a beach. Looks like they got a lifeguard shack. They got a what's called the mud kitchen. Made out of driftwood. I don't know what a mud kitchen is. Mud kitchen. Maybe you do activities. Oh, looks like you do activities with mud. There's sand and bowls and stuff. And then they got a climbing wall, which is always fun. So, just one more element to do here. Maybe a little more suited in the daylight when it's not kind of cold and rainy like it is right now. Okay, we're about to end our day here at the Children's Museum. What did you think about it, Mama? Um, really fun. They have some displays are missing because of COVID. But for the most part, there's still a lot of stuff here to do. Definitely worth four bucks on the first Friday of each month. And um, I would say it's actually probably worth full um, $16 admission on normal days if you're out here in Olympia area check this place out for sure to end the day yeah we had a good time it was definitely a good value and Everly absolutely loves it she's still running up and down the stairs right now so it's definitely a good place to take young kids there's many many activities to do and definitely a great place for them to ex expend their energy if you like these type of travel videos and location videos Give us a big thumbs up, that helps the channel. Also, if you're not a subscriber, please do. And make sure and smash that bell so you can join us on our next adventure. And at the end, there is a gift shop you can check out. And they also have, looks like a little cafe where you can get some food. Here's the gift shop. You get a coho salmon for 20 bucks. Various activities and critters. We got some ice cream. And it looks like it's like under normal circumstances you get some uh, sandwiches and some pizza as well. Check this out. Look at this guy. Now look at this guy. Oh wow. <laughs> it looks like Abraham Lincoln on one side and who's the other guy? It looks like His, a Wenatchee uh, bro. It, it looks like Sasquatch's cousin. <laughs>